Now, the Ministry of Information, Communication and Digital Economy is calling for realignment of operational processes by postal and logistics firms in the East African region in line with technological advancements. Now, CS Eliud Owalo says the government is resolute in its mission to propel Kenya to a transformational digital economy. The rapid growth of e-commerce has posed a new challenge in the operations of postal and logistic firms to shape how they approach package delivery. As such, the Ministry of Information, Communication and Digital Economy, Cabinet Secretary Eli Dowalo, says there is need for creativity to leverage the network to satisfy the growing demand for last mile delivery. The surge in e-commerce has underscored the pivotal significance of the postal and courier sector. It is an industry on the threshold of unprecedented change where innovation is the key to fulfilling futures. Speaking during the second East African Communication Organization Post and Logistics Forum in Mombasa, Cabinet Secretary Eli Dewalo noted that there was need for those in the public sector to be proactive in their approach in order to be equal competitors in the private sector entities. We cannot continue with the traditional business models that we have been used to in the postal sector. It calls for strategic agility and maneuverability. We have to reorient our business models to survive or to remain relevant in the operational environment, ladies and gentlemen. The CS pledged support for conducive digital-driven environment in Kenya, where both the public and private sector organizations will thrive. This industry, ladies and gentlemen, is the livelihood of e-commerce in Kenya and the broader East African region, for that matter. And it therefore demands our unwavering commitment and attention. Trevor Nyinde for Prime Edition. Now, the trading licenses of 64 coffee buying companies will not be renewed for failure to trade on the Nairobi Coffee Exchange. Nairobi Coffee Exchange Chair Peter Gekonyo says the coffee auction only attracts an average of 25 buyers weekly, despite hundreds of buyers being licensed. This is 